Crude oil, daily forecast, March 18th, fxempire.com. Light sweet crude had a positive showing, as you can see on Friday, uh, but did give back a bit at the 94 handle, forming not really a shooting star, but something kind of close to it. However, before you get too bearish, you need to look at all of the noise that we see just underneath between 93 and 92. That being said, we think that any pullback here will more than likely be met with buyers and we are more than willing to go along with it. We think that we finally break out. We, uh, If we get above uh, the 94 handle, we will aim for 96. And then if we do get uh, above that uh, somewhat, we, you can see that uh, there is quite a bit of noise up here all the way to 98. So that would be your first target would be 96, your second target would be 98. As far as selling is concerned, we think 90 is a pretty solid floor, and there's obviously a lot of buying pressure underneath, so we're really not interested in doing so at the moment. Looking at the Brent market, it's a little bit different picture in the sense that uh, on the daily chart it doesn't look so enticing, but on the weekly we did form a shooting, or a hammer, excuse me, which of course is a very bullish sign. Above 111, uh, we finally see a little bit of a breakout. We think we run to about 114 first, and then after that, we could run as high as 117, which was the recent high. It's going to take a lot. It's going to take a lot of grinding, and we don't expect this move to be super fast. But nonetheless, we think a breakout above 111 is significant, at least for the medium term. As far as selling is concerned, we think 108 is the floor, and until we get below that, it's difficult to do so.